P3 has most recently released a white paper on the evolution of Tetra. Um, we think that um, uh, the future of Tetra is Tetra again, and we pro propose to call it Tetra 3. Um, with this white paper, we want to start a discussion within the Tetra industry um, on the evolution of Tetra. We, we think that um, having learned from the past, from the past 20, 25 years, uh, is that um, in um, professional mobile radio, uh, we always have to reuse and refine um, technologies of the commercial mobile radio markets. That's a um, natural law of um, professional mobile radio. And um, of course, the new emerged mobile radio technology on the commercial market is long-term evolution, LTE, and uh, a forthcoming broadband mission critical mobile radio technology should be based on LTE. That's our main proposal. This has a huge impact on the PMR industry because we think that um, all the quality of services and uh, which are and low latencies which are needed for broadband video applications can only be fulfilled if um, the reference points and the interfaces of the infrastructure of the evolved packet core are reused in Tetra as well. This means that we will have a multi-vendor uh, market for the infrastructures as well. This is completely new to the PMR market. Uh, and we think that um, having looked back to the past years, that one major deficiency of Tetra is that there's no control room interface, no standardized control room interface. And um, uh, we think that there's a need for a broadband control room application programming interface to enable application providers to um, develop broadband applications for all possible infrastructures. So, um, so we come to the conclusion that um, you, um, you need standardization for the next 10 years um, and, um, and we need spectrum. We think it will be two times five megahertz, just like in the US. And, um, and we need intrasystem handover to Tetra 1 and Tetra 2. And um, maybe Tetra 3 can become a global PMR broadband standard um, also for um, um, uh, for North America and Asia, so interworking to P25 and Tetrapole should be supported as well. So all further details can be read in the white paper. You can download it from uh, our website. It's called www.p3-group.com. So have a look, and I'm looking forward to discuss the white paper with you.